Schleisheim Airfield near Munich, 8 a.m. Preparing the U.R. Junkers 52 for takeoff. The plane with the BMW engines was manufactured in 1939. For more than 40 years, it served as a transport aircraft for the Swiss Air Force. Today, the U is operated by an air club that organizes sightseeing flights. Many people are interested in the historic aeroplane. During the 1930s, the U-52 was one of the world's most reliable and most comfortable aeroplanes. Designed as a cargo plane, Professor Hugo Junkers soon realized the U-52's potential for passenger services. The so-called Auntie U became the world's first series production aircraft. More than three and a half thousand planes were made and equipped with BMW engines. But BMW aircraft engines have a much longer history. BMW was founded as an aircraft engine factory in 1917, during World War I. The first product, Aircraft Engine 3A, was already so good that it took the company only a year to acquire a great reputation all over Germany. Pilots were keen to have the new BMW engine in their biplanes. The BMW powertrains were designed for greater altitudes than other aircraft engines of the time. This meant that pilots could ascend faster and fly further. Only one and a half years after the foundation of the company, BMW had to stop production of aircraft engines because of conditions laid down in the Treaty of Versailles. So BMW started to develop motorcycles and cars. Again, the engines attracted attention. By applying their aeronautical expertise, BMW made engines that were extremely high revving, economical and reliable. By the late 1920s, BMW had lost touch with developments in aviation. Therefore, the Junkers 52 and later the Fokker Wolf 200 were equipped with an American engine produced under license. By making improvements, the BMW 132 was created. Thanks to its durability, operators of historical aircraft don't have a problem with spare parts. We have propellers in stock, we have individual cylinders in stock, we have entire engines in stock. We could exchange an engine every day because we have them stocked in unlimited quantities. Auntie U accommodates 17 passengers. Each has a window seat. In the cockpit, two pilots and an engineer work in a very tight space. The one or two hour flights with Auntie U regularly sell out. At 160 to 300 euros, tickets aren't cheap, but the upkeep of an aeroplane like this is expensive. Each of the three BMW engines has 660 horsepower, enough for a cruising speed of 190 kilometers an hour. Old Auntie U is definitely not in a hurry. The Junkers were also the most economical aeroplanes of their time. Deutsche Lufthansa posted its first profits when operating the U-52, partly thanks to the state-of-the-art BMW engines. This is a civil aircraft engine, and it was designed with a long life cycle in mind. Quite contrary to military aviation where performance is key, longevity was a major issue here. The Swiss U-Air U-52 has seen 66 summers. According to experts, the vintage plane could fly another 20 years. Longevity due not least to the reliable BMW engines.